convincing win on his part. That was that was a damn good game watch. I'm very I'm honored to lose to him. I don't blame you. I was mostly teasing. Mostly teasing. He's, so he's betraying his name. So this is Deli Bird and Sparky. Deli Bird used to play Deli. Apparently he does not. He doesn't want to play against this matchup. Okay, and Sparky obviously play. plays Pikachu, who uh, does beat Deli pretty badly. For those of you uninformed, uh, if you did not have a good childhood and did not watch the Pokemon anime, yeah, Sparky yeah. was the name of oh, Richie's, Richie's Pikachu. Yeah, Richie's Pikachu, yeah. Along with Zippo and Happy. Yes. Zippo the Charmeleon, Happy the Butterfree. Yes, yes. Did he have any other Pokemon? I can't think of any off the top of my head. I think in a Pupitar in Gold Silver, like in Jota League. Or Pupitar, Pupitar, I don't know. I, uh, my, my, my viewership declined after uh, first gen. gen. I one. think mine just declined after gen people realized that I watched it. Yeah, oh no, no, I have no shame, no shame. I would, I don't know, if, if somebody, like, we recently watched the, uh, the, 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 the one based on the manga, what was that called? Pokemon, Pokemon Origins. Origins? That was amazing! And I watched that like get, a year ago. So like, If we could good. get more Origins, yeah. that'd be great. That if I could get a nut oh. busted seat that I feel like I'm going to die, that'd also be great. Wow, John. Just switch one. There's sweet seats over there. Boop, boop, boop. Pokemon <laughs> Origins, though. <laughs> Damn, was it good. And it was short. Four episodes. It could have been way Wait, longer. Wait, it was short? It was four? Four episodes. Oh, my God. Yeah, exactly. They missed a lot. They flew through everything. Yeah, now I remember Lavender Tower was like a minute. Like, it was like a montage. It was, I think it was literally a montage. The ending, though, Mega Charizard versus Mega Mewtwo, that was pretty good. That was. Or actually, regular Mewtwo. Yeah. Man, please, please, Nintendo, I know you're not listening, and I know you'll never listen to Americans, but please, another Pokemon Origins. Think of please. that gif with the cat, with the paws up, just... Please, Nintendo. <laughs> Nintendo, what are you Nintendo, doing? Nintendo, please, more Pokemon Origin, please. I'm also looking forward to the next gen of Pokemon games. Yes. There's a rumor that they're just going to skip right to 7th gen. I would really like that. Oh, oh. Well, that's us. All right, we out of here. Uh, is your first time commentating? Uh, second or third. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. All right, so we have Sparky and Delibird starting off. Go! Gotta say, I really like, enjoy watching both these players play. Like, Deli has a really good corn and Sparky's Pikachu. So do I. And it, the thing is, with uh, Corinne, I haven't seen much of her. I haven't played with her too much. But I think how new she is really screwing with a lot of people during this tournament. Yeah, it's hard to learn the matchup in even like a week or two. Absolutely. A lot to learn about the character. Yeah, that's why Bayonetta's doing so well in this tournament. You see a lot of really good Bayonettas. Yeah, for sure. But both players doing pretty great in neutral. Uh, absolutely. Oh. We'll see how uh, Pikachu's face against Corn. Do you think Sparky can, can control the ledge game? It might be hard because Pikachu is a very difficult character to edge guard as it is, but Corn mm -hmm. uh, has some tricks. So oh, we'll yeah, see. absolutely. It's not a matchup I've seen yet, so. I like to see, yeah, I haven't seen this matchup at all. It's interesting. Alright. Sparky with the percent lead, zoning him out pretty well with a Thunder Jolt. Okay. Ooh, up. Deli's kind of, kind of having a hard time keeping Pikachu out. Ooh, oh, risky side yeah, B. Yeah, not a very side B on that. Yeah, not Ooh, nice thunder. Yeah, I was about to say, Sparky's utilizing these thunders. What that? Ooh, well, that well, counter. Not. Yeah, Dang. I was about to say, that counter's ridiculous. Oh, uh, it hurts. I had no idea. <laughs> I had no idea Corinne's counter was that strong. Oh, I, I tasted it for... Ooh, Ooh, but that wow. thunder. Yeah, that's thunder. Yeah, it's Sparky's utilizing his thunder really well. Yeah. That's very, that's very interesting. Uh, Corrin's that uh, that stun pla um, planks with the uh, Thunder Duel, so it's gonna be very hard to. Yeah, Pikachu's fair being it out. Absolutely. 
So a lot of Corrin's cash, uh, including her tilt, down tilt, um, oh, all send them upward, so it's a great way for Corrin to follow up vertically. Ooh, nice little empty hop there. Oh, yeah, Sparky's keeping out. Ooh, yeah, he is. The raw forward smash. Yeah, you're Again, <laughs> speaking he's of utilizing the thunder really well. Ooh. Another sick thunder. Yeah, exactly. Any more? Uh, he's Sparky's a neutral. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, read the is. counter and he's gone. That was a good game. Sparky's neutral game. Yeah, it's great. He's killing right now. I really, I really like what I'm seeing. I wonder what adjustments um, Deli Bird will make to uh, Sparky's Pikachu if he decides to stay Corn, because I know he's a he's a King DDD main. So. Well, I wonder what Corin's or Corin or however you pronounce it, what her best. What is what would be a good matchup stage against Corin? Corin against Corin. Um, I mean, Corin has a lot of tricks with platforms, I mean, like with the uh, side B. Mm -hmm. Like on yeah. moving platforms, I've seen people just stick them and drag them across. So uh, you think if you just did the FD, like that would be the best thing to do? Yeah, to do. you probably will want to get rid of like moving. Like uh, Town and City um, has a low ceiling, so counter can kill really early. Oh, absolutely. Uh, even on, even on Smashville, like Sparky was not. In the, like he was in like a mid to high percent, and that counter just knocked him out. So. Where do you think they're? Oh, they're going to Town City. Ooh, speaking of which, and he's staying. So, let's see what Delhi has learned. Yeah, Sparky seems to have a pretty good hold on the matchup. Mess with the group and tell them on the street. <laughs> see, there it was, Mom. Ah, that's in the rolling. Yeah, see what I mean? Thunder Jolt's so fast, he's uh, not going to be able to use that neutral B very well. Maybe the bite, but not the stun itself. Looking much better for Deli right now. A little slow on the down smash, no problem. Looks like the small punish. Deli's only adjustments this game, so far, has been sticking to... Like a little more on like the spacing as well. Yeah, like, absolutely. Uh, yeah. Nothing in the shield, because Pikachu has great frame beta. There we go. There we are. And see, I love that move. You can mess with people Absolutely. so badly. You can go, you can go forward, back. And with Deli playing the middle of the stage better. Yeah, his neutral is pretty on point. Exactly. I think that's going to. I think that's going to help with the rest of the game. Though Sparky looks like he's got a little bit on him right now. Yeah, see, great way to recover. Exactly. Ooh, another thunder. That move is so scary. It's weird. You don't really. I don't often see a lot of Pikachu's use um, that thunder as much as Sparky is right now, but I just think it works on Karin really well. I think Sparky utilizes uh, Thunder very well, and uh, Wawa Peach utilizes the uh, Quick Attack very well. Oh, so they have two different styles of Pikachu. Uh -huh. Ooh, what for the counter? Ooh, and misses the up smash. Interesting. Perhaps a little invincibility at the end of the move. Ooh, nice throw from Yeah, I didn't know that killed. See if we can pack in a little bit of extra credit. Corns within kill percent, a good up smash or forward smash will do it. Let's see if Sparky can get that kill through. But, ooh, there's that neutral beat. That bite, so strong. It's like 16, 18% right there. Reaching a bit with that forward smash. Looks like Del. I wonder how much damage Deli can get on. So far, he's Sparky, doing pretty yeah, well. Like yeah, 66 doing pretty well, credit. yeah. I take that. For something so. For two matches that have seemed so evenly matched. Yeah, I feel like both players are starting to we really learn each other. Oh, yeah. Nice attempt on the thunder there. Could have, uh... A lot of good smashes this game. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Both players are fishing. They want the kill. It's a matter they of both want the kill it. at this point, really. Bad. Yeah, things are looking that great for... Ooh. Yeah. Things, things aren't looking too great for Sparky right now. Yeah, 88% and still has a stock deficit. There it is. There it is. This just puts Sparky in a terrible position. Oh, nothing that Pikachu can't make back. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, what kind of confirm we're going for? Yeah, both players are just, you know, dealing each other out, getting a couple blows in. Ooh, uh. there's a stun, and... Ah. Uh, is that it? Oh? Well, that... Is that it? Ooh, that was very close. That's not game. Almost. I feel like every move that Korn has is a kill uh, move. Absolutely. Like, it's kind of scary. Ah, and there's the there back air. One to one. That back is right. ridiculous. Those players, great adjustments. Uh, no, you can't fish for the kill. 
No, you can't. When you lift, that's when, like, Sparky got up to, like, 88% while Deli was still living to, like, 130. This can't be fishing. Oh, no, no, no. Alright, so let's see what stage we're gonna go to next. Like I said, you wanna avoid the lower ceiling. So. Yep. Anton. Yo, what's up? Yo, what's your name, man? Keeps. Name's. Tags Anton. Name's Nick, though. Okay. Follow me on Twitter at Nick was here 26. Sorry, Nick Griffin 26. Nick, I changed my tag like a week ago. It's Nick Griffin 26 now. My so, tag what we have here, Deli Bird and Sparky, are both at. Uh, Yeah. So I was gonna say that uh, Sparky and Delibird are tied up 1-1 right now. Okay. But what's interesting is that um, uh, Delibird's adjustments, he kind of played the neutral game better, and he avoided uh, Pikachu's thunders, which Sparky really likes to utilize. Yeah. And they're both second game. They both really tried to go to stretch for kills. Uh, and it seems like every one of Korn's moves is a kill move. Everyone. Not every single one. Oh, yeah. uh, the up air is a really good option. Mm -hmm. It's probably her safest option as a I kill think move. The last kill was a uh, back air, I believe. Back air is also good. It covers, oh, yeah, a covers a lot of range. But Pikachu seemingly seems pretty good in this matchup. Pikachu mm -hmm. can get all over Korn. Korn only really has neutral air to keep Pikachu right off Korn. Mm -hmm. And right now, Pikachu is just kind of playing a hit-and-run style. I was also going to say, I don't really know um, Korin's playstyle that much. I haven't played with her that much. So this is an interesting matchup. We haven't seen this that much. You don't really see something like this that often. Uh, Korin's more defensive. You try to use her range, try to space correctly. Um, but she does have good frame data up close, so that is pretty good. She has a very fast jab. Mm -hmm. Frame 5, fastest of the Fire Emblem characters, if I'm not mistaken. And her grab is really good. has pretty good range, and it comes out really quick. Yeah, I know, I know a lot of the Pikachu users. And the thing is, I've never seen a Pikachu use Thunder as much as he does. As much as Spark does. I've never seen a more offensive Pikachu than they're playing right now. Usually a lot of Pikachus I know are super defensive and like prey off the mistakes of especially a player like Corrin. But Sparky's being really aggressive and this match is really working towards his advantage. Yeah, I know, I'm pretty surprised. Sparky hasn't really been using quick attack that much no. to just kinda get some quick hits in. He's just been A lot of odd spacing, a lot of weird stuff and that I guess that's that's one of that's what one of this game. Yeah, that was a really convincing win that was on Sparky's nice. part.